Okay. Okay. So. Well, well, like, no. <laughs> All right, so today I am going to learn how to throw a spiral from one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL. You put a lot of pressure on me. All right, <laughs> you, you better be a good student. Now here's the thing: right. every time I throw one of these, mm -hmm. it just gets out of control. Yeah. You know, and so can you give me some tips? I'm going to give you just one main tip. I mean, just holding the ball is just more about comfort because everybody holds it differently. You'll see a bunch of NFL players, and they all hold it differently. So it's not so much about how you hold it. But it's how you release it. Okay. Because with most sports, like if you're throwing a baseball, you know, you bring your wrist down through it. Or if you're shooting a basketball, same thing, you bring your wrist down through it. If you do that throwing a football, it comes out all funny. So the key is when you release a football is you push down through it so your hand actually comes backwards. Okay. You know, so you're pushing through it. And so instead of finishing like this or like this, you're finishing with your hand Pushing down. And, yes, exactly. So the back of your hand is kind of facing your body. Okay. And that's where you get the spiral. So okay. that's what you got to try, okay? You got to make sure you get the right finish, the right release, okay? Okay. So, so oh, look at that. You. Wow. A, a release from quarterback Kurt Warner. Right. And you guys always lick the hands. Do I need yeah, to do that? I, I don't think you need to do that. But I okay, still do I that to do this that. day when I'm coaching my... <laughs> My uh, high school players always, you know, make fun of me because they're like, you're always licking your hands. I'm like, I don't know, it's just, just a habit. Okay, here we but go. Yeah, pushing through. See what I'm All saying? Right. I see what you're saying. <laughs> so you got you to gotta push through hard so when you finish the follow through that your hand comes oh. backwards. Sorry. Okay, well, I guess throwing. I'm not trying I mean, out. You actually it. have to scoot back a little bit I'm so not you can actually <laughs> throw it a little harder. That's I, the key. Kurt, I guess I won't be yes. at the combine this year, right? Maybe not this okay, year, let's but we'll try work on it for now. All one right, so more. really snap your wrist through and push it back. All and right, if I don't get through. it this time, I promise I'll practice. And okay, then I'll sounds take good. your tip. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh a little bit bad. better. Wasn't bad. A little bit better. Touchdown! <laughs> okay, you look good doing a touchdown <laughs> dance. So in the shoes too. There you go. Thank you so no much. Problem. This is Thank gorgeous. You. And, it. Thank you. and I said to Kurt, you could have training camp out here. <laughs> These kids are finally exposed where they can play the game of football. Believe me, a game that they love. What advice would you give rookies in the league? Ooh, that was a nice whistle. <laughs> What advice well, we would you? We have the rookie punter there, over here from you, the Niners, you yes, know, and, exactly. and he, I would say you better be good. Look at that guy. Look at that punter. And he, and he is pressure. decked out in his Niner gear, by the way. There's pressure on him uh, because he's been placing a pro bowler for nine years. <laughs> Joining me, former San Francisco 49er player, Dana Stubblefield. We work together. Uh, it's It's been, what, how many years now? Oh, my goodness. Uh, we, we don't want to count back. <laughs> no. It has been a while, but yes, it's it's uh, great to see you. It's good to see you. Yes. We won our Super Bowl rings together. So you've been on the golf course lately? Yeah, every day. Really? Favorite golf course to play at ever? Um, the the best course that I've played that I had my um, my oh god moment, uh, <laughs> um, and I I've had this pleasure to play there on two different occasions. Um, I have about four rounds under my belt was Augusta. If you just think about it, it's the only, it's the only major in golf that they don't change venues. Mm -hmm. so and people continuously <laughs> struggles with the course. Sure. It's not like you're going to a new course each and every year. It's the same course. Coach Jim Tomsula, and we have some friends here with us. What are your names? My name's Jimmy. Jimmy. My, 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 I call me the, the Rock. Oh, the Rock? Yeah. Look at this, the Rock because of all these muscles, right, Jimmy? That's right. Well, I spent some time yesterday at Levi Stadium, and players just raved about you and their camp. They just wrapped up. What team this year are you looking most forward to going head-to-head -head with? Oh, that's a good question. Um, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm looking forward to playing against everybody and being my first year. Uh, you know, the Cowboys, being able to play against my brother's friend, Tyron Smith, that'll be fun. Now, Coach Steve Mariucci told me you wanted to work for him. Is that true? Yes. What do you want to do with him? Um, I, I want to um, help him make all the predictions right on, on the NFL and pick uh, different teams who's going to win each week. So you know or you can actually predict every week in the NFL what team's going to win? Yeah. Being from Louisiana, Baton Rouge boy, mm -hmm. what's your favorite dish? Because there are so oh. many great dishes. Etouffee, Bananas yeah. Foster, what's your favorite dish? My grandma's gumbo by far. Um, 
You know, the funny thing is being in California or anywhere for that matter, um, there's always New Orleans style this, New Orleans style that, Louisiana style this, and it's never, it's never the same as, as grandma's gumbo or grandma's etouffee. So um, if, if my grandma cooks it, it's, it's probably my favorite. Mm. <laughs> see what I'm saying? Uh, I see what you're saying. So you know much. This is Thank gorgeous. And, and I said to Kurt, you could have training camp out here. <laughs> it's amazing.